Today I'm going to be unboxing the Brahma standalone ambisonic microphone. So let's get in. Okay. So it comes in a case. It looks like it also comes with all the necessary cables. This is a breakout cable. And Cat 5E patch cable. I believe that goes to the power supply. Let's take a look. Oh, that's beautiful. And there it is in the travel case. Got the microphone itself. And this is a windshield for it. And the power supply. Oh, nice. And it comes with the shock mount. It's excellent. Here's what you receive in the Brahma microphone shipment. The microphone itself with shock mount, two windscreens, which I thought that the small black one was actually a pouch for the larger one, but according to the document that was sent online, that is an additional windscreen. The power cable, uh, so that's the power adapter. I still am not sure what these are. These are four rubber bands and an allen wrench the breakout cable a shielded cat 6e cable this is three meters long and this connects to the bottom of the power adapter and the other end connects to the breakout cable the whole piece looks great however one thing that I saw as a flaw in this shipment is there were no instructions whatsoever. I checked the packing list and inside the box, inside the case, and inside the wooden box, and there are no instructions or documentation whatsoever. I did check on the Dropbox link that was sent to me, and there is a document, but it's kind of an all-encompassing document one size fits all uh, it kind of just goes over what they're trying to do with this product and some additional things you might need including other softwares and it briefly touches on what each of these components that you receive are which is where I found out that this is actually a windscreen not just a case or a carrying bag but there's no documentation uh, on what to really do, how to connect things with any kind of Ikea-like diagrams, and I, I have no idea what these four rubber bands are for at this point. Otherwise, it's really great. They have set you up with everything that you need to get started. You can bust this out and start doing recording immediately, so long as you have uh, an accompanying sound card that can support four ends. Other than that, you're ready to go.